Hey YouTube, um, I'm going to do a review of the Songbird Ocarina's Ocarina of Time replica 12 hole ocarina. It's about five and a half inches long and it's probably about three inches tall. And that's the back. If you didn't get to see it. That's the front. Um, this was uh, my first Ocarina that I got, and it it was really easy to learn how to play, and it was super fun, and I still love it because it's my only twelve. It's my only alto twelve hole. It's my lowest sounding Ocarina. It's in the key of C, and um. I will go ahead and play a scale for you so you can hear it. Um, it was a perfect first ocarina, I think. Um, and it size surprised me. When I first saw it, I thought it would be bigger. Um, but after after playing smaller ones, I realized it's not that small. Um, I love this one. It comes with this book, or you can choose this book. I got this book. The There's a bunch of Zelda songs in here. Kokiri Forest, um, the Ocarina intro for the game, um, Sarai's Sir song, and a bunch of others. There's a ton of... The other songs in this. I went to Songbird store probably three weeks ago, maybe four, maybe a month. Um, wait. I think I went there on like the 7th of April. So, like three weeks ago. Um, and they gave me this. They gave me, um, the. The Legend of the Dragon Tooth. They actually wrote a story about this boy finding this cursed man and how he plays an ocarina that was formed out of a dragon tooth. And it's a fun story to read. And I just l love this book because in the back it has a bunch of more classical songs like Amazing Grace, Ode to Joy. The Green Sleeves, What Child Is This Song, um, My Favorite Things From Sound of Music, Skip to My Lou, I Don't Know That Song, The Titanic Theme Song, My Heart Will Go On, um, There's Heaven, Nagaila, There's The Hall of the Mountain King, There's Peter and the Wolf, um, La Cucaracha, Stairway to Heaven, The Pink Panther, theme from Star Wars, um, and then they have Concerning Hobbits in here, which I like, and they have a bunch of fun songs in this book. I should have just summed that up. I love The Ballad of the Windfish, though. That's a really fun song. Um... I guess I could play a song for you, so you can get the idea of what it sounds like in a song. I'm actually going to play, um, I'm going to play the Narnia Lullaby. It's, uh, I don't know how to explain it, but it's from Narnia, so I will play that. Okay, 
I love this ocarina. It is probably my favorite ocarina. It's expensive, but I definitely think it was worth it. It introduced me to a whole new instrument that I absolutely love. Um, and that is up for this review, and see you next time on my, on another video. Okay, see ya.